Hi guys, it's Christina Connolly with another tech tip for you today. Today I'm going to show you how you can jazz up your Gmail templates with something called layouts. I'm going to compose a new email and what I'm looking for is at the bottom of my toolbar here, I'm looking for this little icon that says choose layout. And here you're going to see the different options that you have. It's better to choose your layout before you add any content into your email. If you begin an email and then choose a layout, there's a possibility you might lose your changes. So I'm going to scroll down and take a look at all of the different ways I can personalize my email. And once you've decided on the layout that you like, you can come down to default styling and choose your color palette and add a logo. So if I wanted to upload a logo, which I already have saved here, I'll do that and click on the color to choose what other color scheme I might like. Now, once I've decided on the color scheme that I want to use, I'll click Save Changes and make a note that this color scheme will stick into your next layout the next time you do another email, but you can easily change it down here. And one more thing, don't forget you can choose your font for your email in here as well. So if I wanted to make any change, I could. All right, now that I have my layout, I'll click Insert, and you'll see that the layout now applies to my email. If there's anything that I don't want in the layout, I'll just click it, and I can click Remove Section to remove that piece. And then from here, I'll add in the information I want to add, I can click an image to change the image. I can type what I want to type. And it's important to know that with buttons, you can change the wording by simply clicking over it and typing what you want. And I can also go to a link in this button by clicking change and choosing which link I want to go to. So I would delete the existing information and put in the website that I want this button to go to. And once I'm done drafting everything, it acts as a normal email. I'll add my recipients, my subject, and I'm ready to send. If there's any questions about how you can use Gmail layouts to make your Gmail look a little more enticing, just let me know. Thanks and have a great day.